Hey guys, happy Saturday. Okay, today um, I had no questions, probably because the videos were so messed up, but um, I will address um, a topic, manners. Manners. I will show you the sign for, excuse me, and um, address how you go through a conversation of two people signing, um, how uh, the issue of staring and private conversations versus conversations that are open for you to, to watch in public. Okay. So the sign for, excuse me, this is like, forgive your palm up is in uh, your non-dominant hand, his palm up. Your um, signing hand is like a five with your fingers together and you just wipe the palm a little bit of your non-dominant hand like you're cleaning a board, right? So this is also the sign for forgive or excuse me. Um, but when two people are having a conversation in sign language, and you need to get through them. When hearing people are talking and you need to get through, usually you will say, excuse me, and, and go on, or you'll wait a minute until they acknowledge you and then say, you know, excuse me, I'm coming through or whatever. <laughs> In the deaf world, um, it's better to not even say anything at all, really. But um, to go through, don't wait, don't wait. You just go through. Um, if you can go around so they don't block their conversation, that's the best. If you can't, then duck down and move on. You could sign excuse me as you're going. But just remember, if you're signing or if you're waiting, then you're going to interrupt that conversation um, more. And that's considered rude. Staring. When you meet a deaf person, eye contact is super important. So you're going to feel, because in today's society, nobody makes eye contact. Everyone's on their phones. Everyone's looking around, talking, but you don't make eye contact. So you're going to feel like you're being stared down. And that's fine. That's important to them. That's you making eye contact with them makes them know that you're listening because you listen with your eyes, not your ears. <clears throat> Private conversations. If you see two deaf, deaf people signing um, in, in maybe a, a deaf social or maybe at a restaurant in a public place, <clears throat> um, deaf people are used to people staring at them when they're signing. And most of the time, they're okay with that. It's fine, whatever, they're used to it. But here's a rule of thumb, rule of thumb, for um, private conversations versus con normal conversations that it's, you know, would be considered okay to look at. <clears throat> when they're signing and they're, shoulders are back and they're signing like this with with an area that's kind of bigger and open that means um that anyone's welcome to join in the conversation and it's okay to watch <clears throat> if their shoulders are hunched in forward and they're closer and their signs are smaller that's our whispering so that's um if you see that body language saying um that it's more private that's con that's when it's considered rude to watch so just fyi a few things on manners um, if you have any questions about deafness about deaf culture about sign language anything um, message me uh, and me or 
somebody else from ASL time will answer those on Saturdays. Bye guys.